Today we are going to learn these effects. Part 1, Extrude and Bevel. As soon as you create new file, you will get empty artboard like this. Without wasting any time just create simple text. I am taking word space, but you can write whatever you want. I am taking white fill and black stroke for this project. Once you happy with text layer, go effects panel at the top. And select 3D option, where you can see there is 3 sub options. First is extrude and bevel, second revolve and third is rotate. So go ahead and click on extrude and bevel. When you click, you would have get this window. Before doing anything check preview option at the bottom of window. Now there is lots of values you can play with. But we need to change only things, so for now follow steps on video. Once you happy with perspective press OK. Even you have used 3D effect, you can change texts. So I am making separate layers of each letter. Press Alter and drag to make duplicate. Now I want letter P to rotate differently, I have to go appearance tab and click 3D effect and same window pops up, where you can change the values. Now repeat the steps as I am doing in video. Once you happy with perspective press OK. Press Alter and drag to make duplicate. Once you happy with positions and perspective of the letters, select all the layers and, go to object window and select expand appearance. Now the 3D option from appearance tab is gone, you can't change perspective now. Ok so for 3D grid, we need to create grid from rectangular grid tool. And set their outline to black color. And go to effects, 3D, rotate. And select position isometric top, and send back to the all layers. Part 2, Revolve. Now again create new file. And create text layer as we had done previous example. Now we are going to use Revolve effect. Before doing that, make duplicate of the text layer like so. Press Alter and drag to make duplicate. I made center text as filled and either sides layer with black stroke. Once you done this steps, 
make a rectangle layer as shown in video. Make height same and width half of the one text layer, as shown in video. And go to Windows and select Symbols tab option, if you haven't selected. Once you click on Symbols, you can see, a new tab formed. So now select all the text layer and drag to symbol tab panel. When you drag layers, you can see a new symbol form press OK. Now select rectangle and go to effects at the top and select 3D and select revolve. Before doing anything check preview option at the bottom of window. Now go to map art option, where you can see, we can actually see all the sides of cylinder. Like we just looking at the bottom layer. But we need sides layer so click right arrow at the top. Now select symbol which you have made. As you can see this is not perfectly fit, so adjust it as shown in video. And remember you must select the invisible geometry checkbox. Press OK. And now you will get awesome 3D cylindrical text layer. Go to Appearance tab and change values whatever you want. Part 3 – Rotate Now we are going to use Rotate effect. Again create text and go to effects and 3D and select rotate. Rotate as that perspective you want. Duplicate text layer and swap fill to outline. Select outline text layer, and change 3D perspective like so. Once you happy with positions and perspective of the letters, select all the layers. And, go to object window and select expand appearance. Duplicate the layers like so. That's it guys, I hope, you learn how to use Illustrator 3D effects, thank you guys, bye.